To celebrate Asus' 30th anniversary, they put up a contest for you guys to win some absolutely awesome prizes. One of the prizes is an actual PC build from the man Peter Brands himself. But believe me, that's not all. There's a lot, lot more. Now for more details on this contest on how you can enter yourself, click on the description below. Hey, what's up guys? Jesse here from JP Modified. Finally back with another video. Now recently, uh, last week, we were invited to join a show here in Cebu City, Philippines. It was the first of its kind, hopefully not the last. Uh, it was called Joyo Gaming Expo. Now Joyo is a chain of computer parts stores here in the Philippines that decided to host an event that would feature uh, all the products they carry, um, all the brands they are in partnership with, or let's say all the brands that they distribute. Asus is one of the products they carry. Asus reached out to me and asked me to build a quick build uh, to feature some of the newer products for me to display on their booth at the Joyo event. Uh, some of the products that we use, uh, the Helios and the Maximus 11, we've already featured in other videos. Well, let's cut to the chase and let's get started with the video. The summer's calling The summer's calling If the kingdom is overthrown Meet me at the cornerstone I know that I can't be without you This bond is solid gold We're a diamond and an emerald it took me forever to find you Cause when it's all over The love that you give Will be there to guide you in every way Now we've been Through the cold and darkest days The summer's cold
for the smoke to clear and we watch our dreams appear i know that we can rise together this vision that we share is ours together we can touch the stars i know that we will see december because when it's all over the love that you give will be there to guide you So that was it, we were able to finally build on the ROG Helios case. Now the previous video was just a quick overview on what, you know, on our first impressions of the case. Now this is the first time we've actually been able to build a system inside it. Now we weren't able to do any crazy custom loops or water cooling in this specific build because Asus asked us to feature the Ryujin CPU cooler. So we basically just threw in some parts and we added a little touch of JP Modified on this build. Now my thoughts on this case. Now this is really, really, really important. I'm talking to you guys with utmost honesty. The case was a build to blast in. The case was a blast to build in. <laughs> the case was a blast to build in, actually. Um, everything or they have special features or the case has special features that have already been implemented on other cases however the helios has been able to perfect uh these features now one of the features i'm talking about is the um the stealth cover behind uh the motherboard tray or behind the the case it actually works you can actually close it again after you've jammed up all the cables inside now a lot of other cases from other case manufacturers have this feature too or at least you know the ones that i've been able to work with um that have this feature but you aren't really able to use the the door because once you put in the cables uh it gets too thick and bundled up and you aren't able to close that stealth door with this one we actually closed it as easy as we opened it even with added extra cables the 24 pin cable the uh the ssd cables the gpu cable and everything else uh we were still able to close that panel door or that stealth cover door easy now one of the other things i was impressed with is how to remove the tempered glass panels now it has a little button that you know releases the latch and uh, releases your tempered glass now uh, this feature is also available in other cases but none of these cases or again at least the ones that i've worked with have been let's say as easy or as seamless as the one on the rog helios now other things that actually worked on the case that were not just for eye candy is the velcro strap at the at the top now uh we built a pretty heavy system in it now i know it's not water cool it wasn't water cooled but it did have um you know a heavy gpu a heavy motherboard and a heavy power supply now, so the people who picked up the case from the shop and brought it back actually used uh, that Velcro strap. It was more than able to carry the weight of the case. So if you add in, let's say, uh, two radiators and stuff like that, it will it will make it uh, significantly uh, heavier. Uh, but I think the Velcro straps will still be able to, you know, hold uh, the you know whatever whatever kind of system you put in the Helios. Uh, the front lighting feature was really nice too. Now I did have one problem with the uh, GPU support. Uh, it didn't, you know, it wasn't long enough to reach the GPU. Now I'm not sure if it was because my case or my my motherboard was too wide. Uh, we used the Rampage Six on this one, um, so it really didn't have enough space, or it wasn't able to move to the left a little bit more to actually uh, catch the the graphics card. Uh, so like I mentioned earlier. I really did have an awesome experience building with the ROG Helios. Looks nice, feels nice, the quality is superb as expected, but the Helios does come with a pretty high price tag. So that's all subjective and it's all entirely up to you. All I can say is it was really a good case to build and uh, again the quality is really good and so on. So on how you gauge if it's worth the price tag or not is entirely up to you. Special thanks to T-Force for throwing in the RAM and the SSD. That we used on this build we got tons and tons of other videos that we haven't been able to upload so i apologize for that uh, things have been really really busy so uh, my girlfriend doesn't really have time to edit the videos because she has to shoot 
every time I build and we've been building constantly for the past few months uh, but we do have a lot of videos for you on the pipeline uh, we will be back at our regular schedule I promise just hang in there thank you for your constant support see you guys next week Jesse here from JP Modified mod on